morning and welcome back to another video. Today, th this is the start of the video. I'm not putting an intro in of me making breakfast or making a coffee because that is all I seem to do. So, today's video will be, I'm not sure what it's actually gonna be about yet. I've not planned this one. I planned it, but then I realized I don't actually wanna do that anymore. So, the plan is on today, it's Saturday, so the plan actually today in today's training is, we're gonna do what we were supposed to do last week, but we didn't actually get a chance to because of how icy it was. But we're gonna go back out into the woods where there's a bit of like uh, some fields and stuff and we're gonna practice, we're doing like an hour's session with some race intervals in there. So that'd be three 10 minute race intervals. Um, and they've got a bit like race pace, so it's got to kind of replicate a race. Um, so yeah, we've got a, got a bit of a course set up. When I say set up, it's just a field with some like tracks in it. And yeah, we've got to do some laps down there. Fraser's on his way up, um, so we'll be doing that on the mountain bike, I'll be on the cross bike. And yeah, so we've got these three 10 minute intervals and we're gonna just do laps and rest and recover for a bit. It's kind of classed as a skills life session, so that's the plan today. We'll get on with that right now. There is the bike for today. Uh, I put a bottle cage on there last night. So I can't just put a drink in it, it has to go in my back pocket. Uh, I've also added a Wahoo mount, because now I've actually got a Wahoo, which is uh, more than that in another video, but yeah, got a Wahoo, basically Garmin died. It's one of my old Garmin's that I've had for years for when I used to race, and it just kind of was not having it, so um, yeah, thanks to the Bicycle Lounge, back at the Bicycle Lounge in Ormskirk Bike Shop, hooked me up with a really good price on a new Wahoo, so um, yeah, thanks to Matt. Yeah, we're going to test that out today. I've been testing out for the last few days on the turbo. Um, and yeah, it seems to be a lot better already. So now we're going to test it out on the, not the road, on the bike outside. Yeah. I'm joking. I'm not doing that. Any better though. It makes me feel any better, but I have had a coffee this morning. I've just not showed it you. So. Surge energy powder in that bottle now. So that means 50 gram of carbs, which is in terms of like energy loads yeah so that's from nfuse you can obviously get that online yeah we've been developing that product for a while now with uh, different athletes and we originally had the original surge energy powder which we now increased and made better and blah 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 but it's yeah it's pretty good it tastes really good it's like a lemony citrus but flavor but it's not like a hard flavor you can't like taste and go wow that is lemony citrus it's more like a just it's just a refreshing drink man it's like yeah in terms of refreshing it's like bang on we managed to get that so good so it doesn't leave like a horrible taste in your mouth or anything like that also it's just it got it goes down really easy it doesn't give you any stomach cramps or anything like that because that would be really bad and some people's does that which is really bad um, but ours is just really good it's been developed with you know pro athletes elite athletes so yeah it's just it's just a the shit mate Two slices of ham, bit of cheese, protein shake. Nice. So that was actually supposed to be an omelette and it didn't go up, it didn't go right, it just ended up being scrambled egg. But it tasted decent. Um, I've finished that now. How much protein would be in that? Uh, you're looking about 47 and a half in the actual meal, which was that bit. 
Um, 47 and a half gram of protein and then you've got 25 gram of protein in that so yeah quite a lot quite a good yeah chunk of protein in that so that'll be good for recovery so they are the latest addition to the training package operation mission whatever I'm trying to do at the moment so yeah I recently bought some of these recovery compression sock things that I'm trying out and I've been trying out for the last few days now and they seem to be pretty good to be honest um, the idea of them is to kind of like create like you know to squeeze your, the bottom of your leg kind of get all the blood from your body to like go down to your legs really yeah they seem to be working pretty good I've been just using them straight after training and then on rest days I've just been like wearing them throughout the day as much as I can and then I've not I've not been like sleeping in them or anything like that but yeah so so far they seem to be going pretty good I got rid of the box and everything so I'll put like um I put like what they are here, the exact ones I got and where I got them from and all that. I just picked them up from Amazon because it, it actually was like when I came to look at buying some, there was everywhere was out of stock of like compression tights and socks and everything, so which is weird. But yeah, so they're gonna be about here. I'll show you which ones I got. I do seem to find some benefits with them. I, did, I have tried them without and then obviously with and yeah, they do seem. I do seem to recover a bit quicker after using them. So far, I'd definitely recommend getting them. Yeah, but they'll all be here. Bloody blah, blah, blah. Link in description as well. If I, if I put a link to, you can go and buy some yourself and all that. But um, yeah, I, I've, I've even forgot off the top of my head what the brand they are. But uh, I, you know, I read a bit about them first and all that. So yeah, recovery socks means better recovery and better on your bike and better at everything. So yeah. That's the end of today's video. As usual, thanks for watching. Um, if you give us a like on this video and give us a subscribe, that'd be mint. Um, it'll help people, you know, help the channel and let more people see the videos, which will obviously make it worthwhile for me making these videos. So I, I appreciate you watching this video. So if you could just give us a like and give us a subscribe, that'd be great. And yeah, I'll see you in the next one, which will be soon. Yeah. Nowadays, nothing really excites me.